Welcome back to Bags on the Go. I'm in this passenger seat again, and Ellen's taking me to Mago to go get my wagon. Check out this fresh paint job. Get it right down the road. Uh oh, you'll see this Christmas tree on top of the car. <laughs> so that's what everyone's doing with their wagons right now, and I'm having my wagon painted. So next year, I'll be able to put a uh, Christmas tree. Oh, wow. Yeah, that color looks good. Yeah, that colors look good. Yeah, I did a good job. Man. So she's back in the garage. Let's just do a walk around again before we dissect this thing. There's a few things I want to discuss, but the overall, I'm very happy. Can't beat it. Because you know me, this is all I need is a clean, a clean start to, to start with. I, mean, I ain't even finished yet. But I'm happy for it. It's just a few things I can say. We're gonna jump right on into it and I'm gonna start pointing out a few things, but I'm not upset about it and I'm probably not even gonna notice it to come. All right, so first off, the hood. The hood has one too many little crevices in it and nah, when I'm sitting in the driver's seat, I can see that one. Um, and I don't like it uh, over here right there and stuff like that now this is the type of issue you have when you go to Mako when you don't point out these issues they're not going to fix that they're not going to see that until it's straight to paint and then that's all you see right there it's a little divot that's fine that hood is is beat up anywhere else in this car on this car you don't see any of that so uh, I think this car has been in an accident before so the hood always fit like this super tight on this side see that I hope they opened up the hood and broke that piece away if not I'm about to do it but let's look at it it's, it's, it's looking good it's looking much better even around here see I was asking them I say I want y'all to paint that I want y'all to miss that now and they got it Look at that, it looks good. And then the roof, you know, my favorite body line right there, it looks good. So, it's been snowing today. They called me around two o'clock and said, hey, the car is ready. I was like, I'll be down there later on. I gotta get to work. And then uh, when I get off, I'm gonna come and grab it. And uh, I did just that. And I got the wagon back home. Man. So, in all reality, I got myself a nice wagon with only 1550, 1575 I think it was. They uh, did the body, did the whole roof and the hood. They had to sand it all the way down and then primer the whole car. And uh, she looks so much better now. Glossy. Wait till I put that wood. Wait till I tighten up my hubcaps and you know them tires they gotta go. 
Oh yeah, just wanted to do a little nice little walk around, man. I got the wagon back home. So I dropped it off last Monday and got it back today. It still smells like little mothballs on the inside, but we gonna get there. And you can see, I gotta wipe down the interior again. That's dust. That's all dust. Yeah. And uh, another thing with this back door, I didn't know you could put your key in here, turn it, and the window would drop down. <laughs> so I've been doing that lately. Ever since I found out, I've been dropping it with the key. Check me out. Let me know if you see what I did there. So I'm not gonna do everything tonight. This is gonna be it. This is the first day home. I just really had to see the grill and them headlights in. Frankenstein one side of the head. Just had to see that. Had to. So, we home. I could just stare and stare and stare. But I'm about to put this on the hug cap. So check me out. Oh. This part is still attached to the hubcap. That's the back, that's what actually clicks on, but that rivet right there in the middle, when them break free, it comes right off. So I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade it. Bam.
remember if you want to know where I got these lights from please check the description section it's right up under the title everything I use I'll try to put the link in the description section so you can go and order it and you don't have to worry about where exactly Just click the link and go buy it So they are size. I have a measure. I think that's what they are size. So this is one idea of graphics. Actually, no, there are celebrities that use YouTube. Like Will Smith is big in so it's that. And like, just to make sure, I'm going to grab the other one. Or I'll order twice. So yeah, we're the ones that build it, shit. We're getting all of you. We're going to build it. 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 I thought this was the longest one, so so I guess you can run quick I got a slide of the trailers quickly, but it's honest. It's like what you can see here. So really So one of the guys that posted the very first video has two sides that look the same and obviously it's one that's longer. But you know, fifteen, sixteen years ago, I would say this is a good one to get the one that first of the hours that one that really uses. He posted the description. Basically, the wall. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, But this video, I think, too, I may talk a little bit, then I just may speed it up so you can see me walking around or just use your camera view because it looks good.
also, the more and more I look at the paint job, I find things, but I took it a make though, so I'm not really worried about what I do come up with. Cause it's like, I went to make <laughs> At least I didn't pay somebody $5,000 to paint this, right? For it to look the same way. You know what I'm saying? Oh no, worse. Right, worse. Cause you gotta that. always kind of <laughs> Cause I'm just human. Always gotta come in the end of time that it takes. True. You know, I want this car to be 100% showroom quality, but at the end of the day, nothing wrong with having something that's just A okay. Sometimes you just can't beat it. Here goes his bacon soda because the car smells like mothballs. Whoo, just mothballs. You still smell it? Yep. That thing it has to come out. No way. I'm, I'm never going to get that smell out of there. I can uh, have the car steam clean, seats like that but the carpet has to go yeah it's just a whole that was breath <laughs> breath of um or smell of mothballs but she look good shiny Wrap don't shine like that. Uh, you see the little divots in the uh the hood, yeah. No. Look right ridges. there. Nothing you can do about it. Like get a new hood. <laughs> yeah. Or they could have done some better uh body work, but you know. You know, sometimes you don't see that till after. Sometimes you don't see stuff like that till after. That too, and Mako ain't gonna do it if they see it. <laughs> yeah, you gotta pay you for it. You know what I'm saying? They gotta pay for it. They be like, well, damn, man, why you ain't calling me? You guys are talking about that shit. Working on the vinyl now. Huh? Working on the vinyl to go right over that old looking. Wood. Well, actually, it's vinyl. Super old. I made a mistake and subdo gray. And when we got the render for it, didn't really look good next to the blue. So then we told her to do blue looking wood.
Thanks for watching my video all the way through if you made it up to this point. And if you didn't, if you skipped all the way to the end, man, I thank you for watching too. But uh, she's home. And as you can see, I got right to work with the new headlights in, with the new bezels, uh, put the roof rack back on. I put the rear back door uh, vent visors right here. I put them on. I had to custom fit them. Uh, the hub cap. Let me see. Let me see if I can point. There you go. The hub cap, the centerpiece. Oh, new stock. Put them on. I gotta get the other side now. Only found two online that was dead old stock, so I purchased it. She's looking good, shining. Looking good, shining. Yeah, so uh yeah, so thanks for watching my videos. Bags on the go. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification button so you know when I'm dropping these videos. Now I got right back into it and started hooking up the Parisian, the Impala. I'm, I'm right in line with some more videos, so y'all make sure y'all tuned in for the Impala update. I'm doing the interior seats, carpet. We are gonna finish that ride. So hopefully by the end of this month, we all set, we can push that car to the side. And guess what, we headed straight to the muffler shop. And this one's going to the muffler shop as well, so. Stay tuned in, this bag's on the go. And I'll see y'all next time.